Hi guys, in uh, this video I will uh, teach you how to deploy uh, Windows 10. There is many many tutorial in uh, the internet. They talk about deploying uh, Windows uh, 10, but I found uh, a description, a script to deploy uh, Windows 10, and it uh, work very very fine. Why we need uh, to deploy uh, Windows? Windows 10. Windows after uh, every update, it comes with uh, many many unwanted uh, software and uh, unwanted uh, service that's running in the background. Also, it's come with uh, many unwanted uh, uh, software installed in the registry. So to do uh, the the plot, as I told you, there is a secret and it's open source. The secret is open source, so you can go and you can check it. So what you have, what you want to do, first, you have to open the the term, uh, the PowerShell as admin. And you type the secret. So now I'll show you the secret. Deep. Okay, this is the script. You copy it and you go to the PowerShell and you pass it, press enter. Now the script is running. So here you press remove all blood bloatware. Remove all the blood. Bloatware. And look, it's removed. You see? And build all blah 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 and put this uh, okay. The task is finished. Now disable Cortana. Cortana is disabled. Stop edit PDF takeover. You press it. Uninstall one and drive. You uninstall. Disable telemetry tasks. Disable. Unpin all tiles. And my tea. Wait, wait. wait. My tea. Because as I told you guys, I prefer black tea with milk. <coughs> Coming soon, guys. So, let's check if everything is fine, yes. Unpin the tiles from start menu, you do it. Remove blotware registry keys, you do it. Disable this, okay. Enable dark, uh, dark mode, you enable it. And after that, when you finish, you have to make the restart. Okay, so you close this, and I will put for you the command in the description below. So let's close. Uh, I 
after that when we upload the video we put it in the description so now we are done thank you guys as I always I hope you will learn something and stay safe and ratu to Benny ciao ci vediamo Now we reboot our system after we finish the deporting and we, after we running the script. So now what we have to do, we go to the data collection and disable the data collection because data collection is software running in the background that collect your data and you don't want these things happen to you. So first thing, you go to the search bar and type GP edit group policy and you open the group policy okay now here you go administrate and here you go windows component and here you go to the data collection and you see I disable them all so open this disable and press ok Next, disable and press OK. Next, disable, press OK. Tim allow telem uh, telemetry, OK. Disable, OK. Disable, OK. Disable, OK. Disable, OK. Disable all. And the things that uh, not uh, disable, for example, you leave it. You leave it. Disable. 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 And that's it. You close this window. You open the PowerShell as administrator. And you type this command. GP update force press enter and computer policy update has completed successfully okay you close this we still not finish from the services we have to disable the service that we don't want so you type in the search engine serve the and press enter and here the service I disable for example I disable this service then connected user experience disable then I go to diagnostic so diagnostic policy service disable I disable from here to here, I all, I disable them all. Then, distributed, uh, distributed link tracking, I disable. Then, download maps manager, I disable. Then, geolocation, disable. Graphic pit VC, disable. Okay. Then, IP helper, disable. And this will improve your windows and make it very, very fast. Okay. Microsoft window SMS disabled. Then phone disabled. Print spoiler disabled. And fax here up there is a fax. There is a service for fax. Fax service. Anyway, you have to, to disable it. Program compatibility disabled. Okay, here BIOS helper disabled. Touchpad service I disabled. 
كاميرا نو ما uh, كاميرا مانيوال بيومتريك uh, مانيوال ضد سايد اه ايرور ريبورتنج ديسيبل انسايدر ديسيبل ايميج اكويشن ديسيبل سيرش مانيوال سيكيورتي مانيوال ويندو تايمز مانيوال اند ويندو بوش نوتيفيكيشن ديسيبل Then Xbox, Xbox, Xbox disable all. Then you close it and you make a reboot again. Then you go to setting and you go to ease of access and you go down. You disable all these. Crosser, I choose this. This is the white and I choose this and I uncheck. Change uh, touch feedback and check this. Okay. Narrator and check all. Okay. Then you go here. Now in the search bar, type system information and you go to system and you go to advanced system setting. And you go to performance and and check all and you choose under mouse check show thumb check this check this check apply then you go to advanced in advanced change The default come with automatic. You uncheck automatic and check custom size. My RAM is 32 gigabyte of RAM. So open the calculator. 32 multiplied by 1024. You copy this number. And you put it here okay then this number multiply it by two you copy this number and you put it here then you make set press ok restart your system and continue close this close this close this Now, uh, the connection, internet connection. You go here to make it fast. Priority, private. If you use the Wi-Fi of your home or in our university, Unibis, it's secure. So we use uh, private. You close. Then you type control. Control panel in the search bar. Type enter net press enter go network and sharing center press this guy then press properties then uncheck the six ipv6 uncheck this and uh, select the pv4 and go to properties check this And type nine nine sorry nine 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 then one 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 and press OK close close and the internet will become faster. So now we we solve the service problem. Now we solve the throttle. You go to the battery icon here you see the battery icon here power options you choose balance and change the plan setting and change the advance in the advance put the zero 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 desktop 
pause paused wireless you have to make it very very good wireless maximum performance maximum performance and uh, PCI Express off off here processor power management cooling passive passive and uh, minimum processor state 99% you change it from 100% to 99% on battery and 99% on clock you press OK you close this and you are ready to go now again you go to setting you make some extra privacy setting you go to privacy disable all speech disable ink disable diagnostic basic off off delete never on fix only fix then uh, history for example when you make uh, in the uh, in the default setting when you make this here uh, this screen is full by blah 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 something good huh? so and check this all and the clear press ok location of camera on microphone on voice activation on notification off account information off phone call off call history off leave the email because we need it in uh, Unibis to connect with our secretary with our fucking professor so we leave it like this tasks off messaging off okay radio off other device off background off you off all these things okay Automatic file download, document off, 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 and we're done from here. You go to personalization, color, you disable the transparency. I choose dark mode, you choose any mode you want, and I choose uh, this, I make it dark done okay and i select uh, the, uh, the, ti uh, the title bar to be dark look screen i choose also the dark i have the dark uh, background i choose it dark and this one start i uncheck this only show application so here only the application show and I minimize it before it was big like this now I minimize it to make it faster go here uncheck this uncheck this only the setting so here only the setting okay go now task manager small you can make it big I choose small icon replace the PowerShell with the CMD so I because uh, now if I press Windows X and I press A so PowerShell will be run like uh, as uh, admin so I check this okay here on so I uh, so I make it always on always show all the applications so always I wish on. otherwise it will be like this so I don't know what is running. So here, this is better to show all your application that's wrong. Now, now Windows become more faster. Let's check taskbar, see how the how it's improved. So look, everything is low. Only this guy, the because I have uh, I record this video so I have the OBS, uh, OBS uh, studio and it's moderate okay performance look with the OBS studio and streaming I have only 28 percent gig uh, 28 is 28 uh, 20, uh, 26 percent of the CPU so it is good 
close. Now, next thing to do, go to share, uh, go to PC. Type PC in the search engine. PC. Right click. Properties. And allow file indexing. Uncheck this. Press apply. Let, press OK. Press continue. Press ignore all. And wait. Wait until this finish. Now uh, in the network, go to the VPN and uncheck all. Device, uncheck notification. Go to, uh, to USB, uncheck and uncheck all. Go autoplay, uncheck. Take no action, take no action. In the typing, uncheck all. Okay. In the mouse, leave it as it is. Printer, uncheck all. So there is notification. Now, next thing. System. Focus assist. You choose alarm only. And uncheck, 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 and uncheck. So there is no notification come when you are doing your job. Tablet mode, uncheck. Don't ask me and don't blah, blah, blah. Here, same thing. Use desktop mode. Okay, that is it. Privacy uh, gaming, gaming, uncheck all. Uncheck all. Disable all. No, no, no. System device, phone, internet, language, account, account, sign in options. Go to the down and check all. So let's uh, see another application. Okay, window by default, when you use the search engine, for example, if you type BBC, here it will show you the BBC, because the search engine in window, in your local machine, is linked with Bing search engine. So it will be search in the cloud and in the local machine in the same time, which take too much energy. To disable the, the Bing search engine, I have the script. So I show you the script and I give it for you. Documents. Uh, deploy. No, no, no. Deploy. Driver. Search. Struct here. Open, open. How to create uh, this uh, registry? I will teach you. Open with the script. Okay. <clears throat> First, go to your desktop, right click in the mouse, new. New text document or a new notepad, open and open it. Copy exactly this code. Don't uh, modify it. Exactly. Control A, Control C, and you go to the 
text editor and control V then control S you save it you close it okay now you name it minute close this also This guy here. You name it. You uh, one click on it, then function key F two, Control A. Control V, you, na you name it. Web search of dot rich. Press enter. Say yes. And we come like this. Then double click on it. Say yes. Yes. Okay. So after that, when you reboot, when you press BBC, there is no BBC news. The search to be only focused on your local machine. When you when you type Trump, there is no Trump. CNN, there is no CNN. So all the search it will become uh, it will uh, it will focus on this your uh, on your local machine, your file, your application, your software, your extra 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 extra, and that's all. So we finished here. From now the user interface. Improve your user interface. For example, look my user interface. There is no bullshit here. So how to improve your user interface? You go to to documents. Where is the documents? Go view. You select uh, show hidden items, file, name, extensions, and you go to option, change. Then here you uncheck this, uncheck this, and you press clear and apply. Then view. In the view, you go down and uncheck use sharing wizard recommended. Uncheck it. And you press OK. And your user interface become cleaner and faster. No, it's still. So now we finish the user interface. We disconnect the Bing search engine. Now next thing, what you have to do? Now tweak. I use this uh, tweak tool. I download it and I will put for you the link in the description below. You can hide the window bar or you can show. You can hide the desktop or you can show. It is nice. Okay, this uh, tool. I have another tool, Winario. Win. No. This is more, uh, little bit more uh, advanced tool. So in this tool, I go, for example, the privacy, telemetry, disabled telemetry data collection. Then I make a reboot. For example, auto-update, disabled, disabled Crotona, disabled. This I leave it. This I leave it. I don't play with it. Uh, Let's see the appearance. No, I don't play with the appearance because not good. Dark theme, no, I don't use. I don't play with it. Behavior, let's see the behavior. No, no, yes, this, this, uh, this able area, blah, blah, blah.
privacy, we disable it. PowerShell, no, we don't play tools. Reset, reset, no, we don't play with this. No, there's another thing. Another thing. Context, no, we don't add anything. Disco. Okay. Disable people. Disable life title. So this is, we disable it. But there's uh, another thing, appearance here, setting. Uh-huh, this, this guy. Here, we make a zero and apply change. Okay, so when you go to look, it becomes smaller. For example, let's uh, go to PC. Then we go to documents. So look, it's become nicer and smaller. And here, nicer and smaller. So where where is the yeah? This also we make it smaller and apply. So the top bar becomes small. Look, my top, top bar is smaller, relatively smaller. So you have more and more space. Especially think if you have long code. This, I uncheck this, uncheck everything. Search, hide, search engine. I search engine. Okay, and that's all. Here again, here so that is it. I make a mistake here, maybe I make it. I made a mistake. Apply, apply. No, let's make it 10 men, it's too much small. 10. Anyway, I have to reboot. After the reboot, let's see the change. So we close this, we close this, no, leave it, close it. So now we have to wait only for the indexing, to finish the indexing. After that, I teach you how to make uh, uh, the clock and the date show in the in the, in the desktop rather than here but now we have to make the reboot after finish the okay guys as always we hope we learn something today and see you soon stay safe andra tutti bene ciao ci vediamo dopo